Hey guys, how you doing? If you're wondering why I have this, it's because it's laundry day today. And I decided to do what's in my camera bag video here in the laundry, laundromat, whatever. I don't really know what to do while I'm waiting for the laundry to, to wash. Oh, let's get started, come on. One minutes. What am I gonna do with that? I mean, like, I, I am gonna shoot the whole vlog here. Yep. Okay. Let's get the job and let's show what's in my camera bag. Starting with the camera bag, I suppose. Now that you've seen my camera bag, which is like the most basic camera bag you can find on Amazon, link in the description, you can, I mean it's very cheap and it's um, reliable, I would say, yeah, I took it like everywhere, even, even out uh, in the mountains, and it's not exactly a bag for the mountains, but anyway, let's see what's inside now. Well, other than my vlogging camera, this is basically all I carry with me. It's yeah, well, this is my main camera, Nikon D7200. Uh, it's considered like a semi pro camera, whatever. Um, I kind of like it. I would like to upgrade to some, at some point, but uh, right now, it's, it's, uh, it's the camera that I have and is the best camera in the world, right? Like Chase Jarvis says, the best camera is the one that you got with. Oh, so, yeah. With this camera, I have three lenses, 85 millimeters, 35 millimeters, and 17 to 50, which is a small range zoom. Not the best in the world, but good lens overall. You know, you got a minor um, thing is that. It tends to get dusty, so you need to clean it. I mean, inside the lens, there's a lot of dust, and when you're shooting at a high f stop, you're gonna get some dust in it. You're gonna see the dust in the pictures. Now let's talk about my favorite lens in that I own, and it I think it's the favorite lens. Period. Uh, the 85 millimeters. That's a nice piece of glass. You know, look. At, I mean, what? Look how big this thing is. Yay! This is my favorite lens. I shoot all, almost all my portraits on this right now. But I did start with 18 to 55, then I moved to the 35. I've shot a lot of portraits with only with the 35. And they were pretty good too. Let's move to Action Cam. It's an Ape Man something 4K. I bought it on Amazon. Uh, Black Friday deal and uh, well it, it's not the best but you cannot expect the best when you pay like 50 bucks but that's the job and yeah that's cool I suppose <laughs> that we got lens cloth filters for video and rocket blower whatever moving to tripod section I have my Amazon basic tripod thing and uh, I've had it since the beginning. I don't use the tripod that much but I, I, it's good enough for me. I don't need the, the tripod to, to be super steady when the wind blows in the mountains so I guess that's good enough. I mean, you know, it does the job. Ooh, I got this bad boy. This, I use this a lot, like a lot, a lot. Um, the Joe B Gorilla Pod. This is like the vlogger's best friend. You can, you know, vlog this thing now. And uh, yeah, this is this is. I mean, to me, this isn't really cheap, but it's good. It's gonna save your ass a lot of time. Pro tip: 
you can use this to put the SD cards inside. It's gonna save you, I mean, you're not gonna lose them. Extra batteries. I usually have the battery grip on the Nikon, so I have two batteries plus an extra one. It, I mean, I, I never get to use the extra one. Then I have these batteries for the vlogging camera, which is in a Canon M50, and uh, well, I need these, I, I use these a lot. Usually three batteries are enough for me, I don't really shoot that much. I never got into the point where I was like, oh my god, I don't have the batteries. Remote for when I shoot my uh, self-portrait, my fine art self-portraits, or and I have the... Ugh. I think it's a Bluetooth remote or whatever, no wires, no nothing. Shit. Amazon Basics remote. It's pretty cool because you don't have to use this with wire and everything. You just go, shoot, done. As you can see, this is my gear. I, I have the Canon M50 which I'm shooting on right now. Let me show you. So this is the Canon M50 with the road mic. This is it. As you can see, I don't have that much gear. Looks like it's done. Now we just, I just need to wait for the stuff to dry. Let's shoot some B-roll. Laundry is done, we're going home and I'm gonna, I'm gonna finish the video at home. Um, see you in a bit. And here we are back home. Um, yeah, I guess what I wanted to tell you is that uh, even if you see that I have all this gear, um, gear is not that important altogether. I firmly believe that gear is not important. You should focus more on the story and on basically shooting than getting the gear, you know? I mean, don't wait that piece of gear in order to start shooting. Just go out, go ahead, go out and shoot. Even if you have 18 to 55 or whatever lens you have or whatever camera you have, just go shoot. It's going to be more difficult to take some shots than it would be with another camera or with another piece of gear that's, that costs more. But trust me, it's better to, to, to just go out and shoot and do the job in whatever way you can and remember the best camera is the camera that you got with you in that moment whether it's the camera on, on your phone or whatever go out and shoot and i guess that's it i will see you in the next video Shoo.